Hello and welcome to Carney Varsity. This is why you need basic upholstery skills. Have you ever admired a beautifully upholstered chair or sofa? The intricate details, the perfect fabric and the seamless finish can truly transform a piece of furniture into a work of art. Have you ever thought about creating something beautiful yourself? Imagine the satisfaction of taking an old, worn-out chair and giving it a new lease on life with your own hands. Basic upholstery is a rewarding skill that allows you to do just that. It's a craft that combines creativity, precision and a bit of elbow grease to produce stunning results. Basic upholsterers bring new life to old furniture. They see potential where others see only a piece ready for the landfill. They use their skills to transform worn out pieces into beautiful and functional works of art. Each project is a unique opportunity to express creativity and craftsmanship. As a basic upholsterer, you will work with different fabrics and materials. From luxurious velvets to durable canvases, the choice of fabric can dramatically change the look and feel of a piece. You will learn how to cut, shape and attach them to furniture frames. Precision is key, and with practice, your skills will improve. You will become familiar with different tools and techniques. From staple guns to tack hammers, each tool has its purpose, and mastering them is part of the journey. With practice, you can create stunning pieces for your own home or even start your own upholstery business. The possibilities are endless, and the demand for skilled upholsterers is always high. Basic upholstery focuses on simpler projects. These are perfect for beginners who are just starting out and want to build their confidence. These projects are great for beginners who are just learning the craft. Examples include ottomans, headboards, dining chairs and office chairs. Each project helps you build your skills and gain experience. Headboards, dining chairs and office chairs are excellent starting points. They offer a manageable challenge and a great sense of accomplishment once completed. As you gain experience, you can move on to more complex projects like sofas and armchairs. These larger pieces require more skill and patience but are incredibly rewarding. Learning basic upholstery opens up a world of creative possibilities. You can experiment with different styles, fabrics and techniques to create truly unique pieces. You can choose to specialize in a particular style. Whether it's vintage restoration or modern design, there's a niche for every interest. Or you can experiment with different fabrics and techniques. The possibilities are endless. Upholstery is not just a skill, it's an art form that allows you to express your creativity and transform the ordinary into the extraordinary. Upholstery involves a variety of materials, each contributing to the overall quality and aesthetic of the finished piece. Each material serves a unique purpose in the process, from providing structure to adding the final decorative touch. Understanding these materials is key to creating beautiful and long-lasting upholstery. The right choice can make all the difference in comfort and durability. One of the most common materials is fabric, which comes in an array of types to suit different needs and styles. Upholstery fabric comes in a wide range of colors, patterns and textures, allowing for endless customization options. Popular choices include leather, linen and stretch fabrics, each offering unique benefits. Leather is durable and adds a touch of luxury, making it a favorite for high-end furniture. Linen is a natural fiber known for its breathability and timeless appeal, perfect for a classic look. Stretch fabrics are great for modern furniture with curved shapes, providing flexibility and a snug fit. Underneath the upholstery fabric, we use other materials like calico and polypropylene to build the foundation. Calico is a plain woven cotton fabric, often used as an inner layer. We use it for covering foam and padding before adding the final fabric, ensuring a smooth base. This creates a smooth and professional finish, essential for high quality upholstery. Polypropylene is a synthetic fiber used for webbing, which is crucial for the structural integrity of the furniture. Webbing provides support and structure to the seat and back of a piece of furniture, ensuring comfort and durability over time. By carefully selecting and combining these materials, upholsterers can create pieces that are not only beautiful but also built to last. The art of upholstery is a blend of creativity and technical skill, with materials playing a crucial role in the final outcome. The upholstery process involves several steps, each requiring attention to detail and precision. Each step is crucial to achieving a professional result, ensuring the final product is both beautiful and durable. The first step is to carefully examine the piece you are working on. 
This involves looking at the overall structure and condition of the furniture. Check for any damage or weaknesses in the frame. This is important because a weak frame can compromise the entire project. Look for tears or stains on the existing fabric. Identifying these issues early helps in planning the reupholstery process. Next, you will remove the old fabric and padding. This is called stripping. Stripping the furniture down to its frame is essential for a fresh start. As you strip the furniture, take note of how the original pieces were attached. This will serve as a guide when reassembling. This will help you when it's time to put on the new fabric, ensuring that everything fits perfectly and looks professional. Once the furniture is stripped, you can begin the reupholstery process. This is where the transformation truly begins. This involves measuring, cutting, and attaching new fabric to the frame. Precision in measuring and cutting is key to a seamless finish. You will use a variety of tools such as a staple gun, webbing stretcher, and sewing machine. Each tool has a specific purpose and contributes to the overall quality of the work. Upcycling takes old furniture and gives it a new purpose. It's a creative way to breathe new life into items that might otherwise be discarded. This could involve painting the frame, adding new legs, or changing the overall style of the piece. The possibilities are endless and only limited by your imagination. Upcycling is a great way to give unwanted furniture a new lease on life. It's not just about aesthetics, it's also about sustainability and reducing waste. No upholstery project is complete without the finishing touches. This is where you address any repairs needed and add details that elevate your work. Start by inspecting the frame carefully for any loose joints or cracks. Tighten screws and use wood glue to repair any damages. A sturdy frame ensures that your upholstery will last for years to come. Next, pay attention to the details. This might include adding decorative nails, piping or buttons. These small additions can make a big difference in the overall look of your piece. Finally, give your newly upholstered furniture a thorough cleaning. Use a vacuum cleaner with an upholstery attachment to remove any dust or debris. You can also use a damp cloth to gently wipe down the fabric. Please subscribe to the Khan eVarsity YouTube channel for more tutorials and tips. Don't forget to like and share this video.